So after that defeat by West Ham, Arsenal's next game is against Fulham at Craven Cottage. I mean, it's going to be another difficult game. West Ham played with that low block and we just could not penetrate it. We couldn't get through it. Fulham will probably do the same. We know Arteta likes to play with possession football, but, you know, we need to try and work out a way of with the players that we've got is to penetrate that low block will you know, it's called a low block nowadays. Back in my day, we used to call it defending deep, sticking 10 men behind the ball. But they've changed the terms and, you know, the way they say things, these pundits nowadays, and they call it a low block. West Ham played with a low block. It is on the counter. Um, but I think West Ham did play well. I've said that in a video already, but this is about Fulham, this one. And I really do think Fulham sitting down in 13th place, it should be a game, even though we're away, Arsenal should be winning. We should be bouncing back, dust ourselves off. I know I've done the bounce back video a couple of times, said the same thing. But Arsenal should be dusting themselves off and thinking, you know what, we're still in it. We're only two points behind Liverpool. If we win this, Liverpool don't play to... I think they play on New Year's Day. I think they've got Newcastle. It's a tough game for Liverpool as well. So the pressure will be on if we can beat Fulham. Uh, uh, we'll go back to the top of the table before Liverpool play. And then they've got a tough game against Newcastle. So... I'm assuming that Fulham will will play with a low block against Arsenal because we will probably have most of the ball again. But how do you combat that? How do you combat teams that sit deep behind the ball, put all them in behind? This is how you combat it. Well, this is what I would do. Surrender possession. Surrender possession. Keep like keep like, a little press on them, but surrender the possession. Let Fulham attack. Let them attack with the ball and then hit them on the counter. And then create space behind. They won't be in that low block. I mean, oh, we, we've got players good enough to do that. We, our defence is solid. I know we didn't play very well defensively against defensively against West Ham um, the other day. But, you know, you've got, you got to think of other options, other, other ways of penetrating. If they're sitting that low, are they sitting defence that deep? And we, we can't find a way through. We could not. We did not look like scoring once. Even though we had 30 shots, 30 shots against West Ham. Um, the ones that were on target went straight to the goalkeeper and had no power in them, really. We could not break through. We need to open up that defence. We need to we need to draw them out. So give them the ball, let them come at us, trust in our defence, and hit them on the counter-attack. I mean, it's worth a try, isn't it? Or would you rather just sit there and watch us try and pepper, pepper, pepper? Well, not even pepper, because we were trying to play around it most of the time. You know, just, let's just try. Let's just try something different. Surrender the possession. Let them, let them keep coming at us and let us hit them on the counter-attack. It's at their ground. We were away. We were at home to West Ham. I know we had 70% of the possession. We couldn't do nothing with it. Try something different. We haven't got the, uh, the striker that we need. To, you know, to throw balls into the box. Because when you try and cross balls into the box, Jesus ain't tall enough to get on the end of them. I know he's got a couple of headers, but not as many as he should have. You know, let's try something different. Let me know what you think in the comments. If you think I'm talking out my ass, just let me know. If you don't agree with me, let me know. If you do agree with me, especially let me go. And subscribe to the channel and stick a like on it for us. Cheers.